Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are watching from. This is Polly Press. Don't mind the way I look. Oh, uh, I bring this video to you for we to, to watch it and reason with it also. You see, this election, what God told me concerning Peter will be, he did not open up to me, but everything, you know, God speak in Proverbs, in parable. So, what I saw, I saw someone crying to Peter B that please, I'm hungry. Give me something to eat. Give me money to buy food. And Peter will be told that person, I don't give people money. And if you watch through during his campaign, he's not sharing money to people. He said, I don't give people money. He asked the person to open his mouth and he dropped two key, two pairs of key in the mouth of that person. So not key, not padlock, the key to open the door. I was not asking in my spirit that what is the meaning of this key? Why giving this person key instead of giving him money to buy food, as he said? So what I now realize is for in the spirit realm, key is a blessing. Key is a something that every locked door, you without a key, you can't go in, you can't open. You even if you went out with your own key. And you misplace it you have to break the door before you go in without the key you can't be able to open the door so that means you will destroy the door so the key signify a, a something good something good coming the person's way but me i just want you to know that that key is not only speaking to that person it's speaking generally to everyone i'm not saying god told me that he is going to win but what I want us to know is uh, we just have to vote wisely. There is this video I'm going to show you now that uh, the Igbo people say they don't want a election in Biafra land. And they are destroying their canopies, the chairs, the DJs. They have to put their things together to put fire. That is not the best way to handle things. At the same time, they are expressing themselves in an aggressive way, which is not nice. Though we have been crying in Nigeria, they seem not to give us a listening ear. But to the government, I think it is time for you to listen to the masses because they are the people you, people you are ruling. If you have one, two children, you can't expect the two of them to abide with your rules. At the same time, there must be one that will say, no, daddy, this is what I want to do. And you have to listen to, to him or her. That is why you see we have uh, stupid children outside today. We have children that are just going roaming about. They, they don't care about their parents. They don't listen to anybody. Not because of the way, sometimes the way they raise them. It's because we are not giving them listening ear. When a child say, this is what I want to do. We say, on that must, this is what I want you to do. That is what is causing the problem today we are having in, the, in our society. So please, the... the Leaders, listen to the masses. If Biafra want to go, so be it. What do we have to lose? We don't lose anything and we don't gain anything. Than seeing people destroying their lives, just innocent people. Those people that are in this video today, they are just innocent people who are just looking for their daily bread. They are there to work to sustain their life, sustain their family, and they are taking their risk. Why the main people that need to their business are sitting in their sitting room taking fresh air, taking AC? Why we are killing ourselves? It's time we wise. It's time we wise up. And secondly, these people, the people we are wanting to vote for, we are wanting to rule, we are wanting to win. May not win. Yes. Because a lot of us are just sitting in the room and we are saying, hey, Atiku, Atiku. And we are saying, hey, Tinibu, Jagaba. And many of us are just saying, hey, oh. Uh, what is his name? Peter will be, Peter will be. And we are not voting. We are not going out there to vote. Let's not deceive ourselves. If you don't vote, how will your vote count? How will it count? It can't count because you don't vote. A lot of uh, Peter will be fans are outside the country. Those that are inside the country, how many of them have PVC? If you don't vote, your vote will not be count. That is the truth. So the people we are wanting to vote may not be the person that we will be there. So that's why we have to go out. Those that have PVC, go out and vote. Put God first. Let God direct your path. Let God lead you. Follow your heart. So that tomorrow you will not blame someone that, eh, suppose I know, a dino will not come at least. I pray that this election will be the ever best election ever. 
We be the election, we be the vote, we be the God, the president, the person God is going to elect for us. We be the person that will take Nigeria to their next level, to their higher level, to their greater height, to where we want to be, to our place, where the paradise, the kingdom God has prepared for Nigeria in the mighty name of Jesus. Please watch this video and leave your comments below, whatever you think or sign your name. If you think they have to go or they have to stay or we have to have one Nigerian, let us know from the comment section. God bless you. God bless Nigeria. God bless everyone in Jesus' name. I still remain Polly Prince. Please subscribe to this channel and leave your comment below. Like and share. And God will continue to be with you in Jesus' name. Bye. We'll be giving them what they want. Uh, this is exactly what they want. In this, we told them there is not going to be election. Our master, Mazin Nandekali, is there suffering. These people, they don't care.